What's up guys, Danny here. Welcome to part two of the shell removal from the frame. I literally just got done lifting the trailer off the ground, leveling it onto the jack stands. We're now inside the trailer, ready to build the structure that's gonna help us actually remove the shell off of the frame. The idea behind the structure is I'm going to use two by fours and I'm going to build them off of each one of these studs. This one here, this one here, and then in the back, I will build one off of here and one off of here. What I'm gonna do is run a two by four stud that will go from about here, attachment point, all the way across level to here. And then I'll build braces, about three of them that go directly up to the top of this stud that I'll attach there. Then I'll run two 10 foot studs from these two by fours inside all the way here to this one here, and that'll help brace it. What that allowed me to do is actually put the pole jacks in place when we're ready for the lifting process. And that structure will actually keep the shell nice and sturdy, won't allow it to twist and bend. So I'm gonna switch this camera over to time-lapse and get started.
What's up guys, part two officially in the books. The structure's been built, broken finger in the process, but all in all, everything is good. I do wanna take a few moments and share exactly how I built this, explaining it to you guys in case anyone's interested for their future restoration. So all I used was two by fours, tying them in with just your basic tie straps as well as your normal screws. And then bringing the actual stud over and using self-tapping screws to attach it there. And then running two 10-foot beams, connecting it and just giving it more stability overall. And then finishing it off by adding just a couple reinforcement pieces where the actual pull jack will go underneath to lift the shell off of the frame. So as I said, part two in the books completed. Time to end this video and start part three, which is the cutting of the subfloor, removal of all the remainder insulation, so we can get this frame and shell separated. Guys, if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button, like this video, share it with your family and friends. And until next time, this is Danny, signing out.